friends, for this week's video we are going to be doing something a little bit different. I thought it would be really fun if I did a finger painting art challenge with my friend. I think it'll be fun. I think it'll be entertaining for you guys to watch too. That's the other reason why I want to do this video. So I really wanted to do an art challenge with my friend and I was having trouble finding one that involve two people. If you have any two people art challenges, please leave suggestions in the comments because this is something that I've been wanting to do for a little while. Uh, so I just kind of made one up. My friend's not really an artist, so I thought it would be fun if we did something that we both have no experience doing, which is why we're going to be doing finger painting. And to make things a little bit more difficult, not that they really need to be, I mean finger painting is pretty hard, but to make things even more interesting, I guess, um, my thought was that we could sketch out an idea and then swap sketches and try to figure out what the other person wanted us to paint and then see if we could actually do it. <laughs> um, I'm gonna put it out there right now that I, I don't know that these are gonna go the way that we want them to, but I do think it'll probably be pretty funny to watch. So there is not enough space in this room here for me and my friend to both do. <laughs> Finger paintings is really a one person setup because that's all it ever really needs to be. So I'm going to be going to my friend's house and I'll see you guys when I get there. And we're here! <laughs> so I am at my lovely friend Victoria's house. Hello! Say hi. <laughs> so yeah, we are going to now do some sketches for each other. I'm gonna sketch something, she's gonna sketch something, and then we're gonna <laughs> switch and see if we can paint each other's ideas. Fair warning, I'm not an artist. No, but, <laughs> but I feel like the finger paints are gonna put us on a slightly even playing field. <laughs> and these are the paints that I used in that dollar store video, and honestly, they're really not very good paints. So, you know, that's fair. It's just for fun. This is just for fun. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's get started. So, we have our sketches. And now we are going to swap. <laughs> Here we go. Ta-da! Hopefully we can do this. <laughs> we got this. Normally I mix paints, so I'll like mix my own colors. I don't know if that's gonna be possible with this. Uh, yeah. I, I don't know, I mean, I'll, I'll try. <laughs> I could try. No, could. there's no law against that. There's no law against trying, you know. Very good. There is not. See, so I got some different types of grass in here, so probably gonna need a couple different types of green. <laughs> Sorry. No, no, no. What? No. Why are you polished? No. I, I don't know. <laughs> no, I like it. I'm gonna try to mix colors. I'm. I'm gonna try. Good luck. Thank you. Okay. Let's do it. <laughs> Right away I can tell that mixing is not gonna work. I'm just gonna try it. This is like hilariously difficult. Alright, just put that on there. Please. Oh man. It won't go where I want it to go. Oh, no. Yeah. I feel like this would be easier if I was using my actual hand, but I really don't want my fingernails to get stained. I mean that's fair. Yeah. Like I don't mind if it's on the top of my nails, but like when underneath it gets stained, that just bothers me, you know? Yeah, you like can't get it out, and you're like, damn you. Yeah. I'm gonna build myself a rocket ship 
have our finished paintings. Woo! They're pretty cute. Um, both of them are pretty cute in their own ways. Also, it started raining, so we had to turn on all the lights because even though it's not really that late, it's like super dark in here. So. Please don't mind the change in lighting. <laughs> so now we have to rip our paintings off the table. Oh, it's like melting. Oh no. Our finished paintings. They're so pretty. Yeah, I think they both came out better than I was expecting anyways. Yeah, honestly, same. <laughs> I feel like neither of us have actually finger painted since we were children. No. So. I never really have. I had fun. Too. They both came out a lot better than I did. expected, so I'm pretty happy. Yeah, I'm pretty happy too. <laughs> I mean, this looks like some type of impressionist painting, but like, it's okay. I had a lot of fun experimenting with how yes. to get like texture she, yeah. on my painting. She did a really, really good job with different types of textures. She, she, did a, she did a good job with the textures and the waterfall and stuff. I just kind of turned this into a big... Thing. Thing. I like it. Here's it's pretty. Thank you. <laughs> oh my god, it's literally it's so thick with paint, it's like melting. If you guys ever try to do finger painting, you can use your thumbnail. If you have long enough nails, you can grow out one of your nails and then use it to do like little tiny details like on the bee, his legs. That's for my thumbnail. Which technically is not cheating, I'm gonna say because it's still your finger. Yes. Yeah. It's still it's still part of your finger, yes. so it works. Yes. Do you have any tips that you learned from yours to share with the audience? Um, do it in sections. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like do one section first and let it dry and then come back and do like yeah. any layers uh, over it that you need. Otherwise it gets like kind of muddied together. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's, a good, that's, that's a good rule of thumb <laughs> for regular painting as well. I mean, that makes sense. Yes. You're, you're, you're right on the money with that. That's a good tip. Okay. Um, I think that's about it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks, Victoria, for... Whee! Thanks to Victoria for allowing us to film in her home. Yeah, I had fun. So. Had fun. Me too. I will see you guys next week. I don't know what it will be, but I will see you there. Bye! 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 <laughs> Set to get